I gotta tell you, I had matcha tea this morning. My husband made it for me. Oh my God. You have no idea what you're missing. Oh my God. Okay. So I haven't been able to have coffee because I haven't been feeling well. I feel like I keep repeating that, but of course it is the truth. I do not feel well and I can't have coffee. My husband made matcha tea this morning for me and he put in coconut cream, milk, no sugar, just organic. He put collagen powder, he put ghee in it. And I put a little bit of salt because I don't use sugar, so it brings up the sweetness. Oh my God. Ah! Stop the fucking frost! Hola. Y bienvenido a Styling Your Lipstick. El fin de labio que tengo puesto para este video is by Pipe Beauty and it's called Toasted Cardamom. I went shopping at Nasty Girl. I haven't shopped at Nasty Girl in like I don't even know how long. And I used to shop there all the time, but I went there and I did some shopping. I'm so excited to show you guys what I have. So let's just jump into it because I don't want this video to be any longer than it is. Okay, let's get into it, bitches. Here I have the flattest bag in history because I already took everything out of there because I want to save time for this video. So let's get rid of that shit and let's go into the first thing that I got is a bodysuit. I love bodysuits. I love bodysuits and look at this color. When you see this color, you're going to be floored. Look at this. The color is gorgeous. It's like a yellow, a more yellowy version of olive. This, this reminds me of my husband's eyes. I love it. I love it. I love it until I looked at the material and I'm like, there goes Daisy. It wouldn't be a video if Daisy didn't complain about something, right? No, that's not true. I'm not really a complainer. But I shop, I work, I put in my money into these things and I want them to be great. I don't like it. I do not like the fabric, but oh my God, let me try it on and stop being a pessimist Daisy and let's see what happens. But I'm not gonna try it on right now because I'm gonna go into the next shirt before this video becomes on. But don't worry, you're gonna see it. So don't worry. Hey, when I was on the site and I saw all the bodysuits that they had, they looked so beautiful. But of course, that's the point, right? So you could look beautiful. Wow, I am fucking jacked up because I haven't had caffeine in so long. Oh my God, I miss that shit. <sighs> wow, I miss a stimulant. This one that I got is a black bodysuit and it has like that sleeveless type of look. It's those type of shirts that just fit your body. It's nice and slim and slug, slug. <laughs> I said slug, slug to your body. And these type of shirts just always look so sexy. But to be honest with you, this already looks like the same material as the last shirt. But I digress. Just try this shit on and see how it works because I might actually be surprised. So let's try them both on right now so you can see how it looks and wish me luck. I love the shirt, I love the color, I do not like the fabric. Here I go again, there goes Daisy, obsessed with the fabric, but honestly I know that once I, I wash it, it's gonna fall apart on me, it's gonna disintegrate, and then I'm gonna regret not returning it. But it just so sucks because I totally love the color. This is the second shirt. It has the same material as the other shirt. And I'm like, mama mia, why are they doing this to me? I know it's going to go bad on me. And then I'm not going to like the fit. But yeah, unfortunately, I'm going to have to return this one too. Next is a pair of shorts. When I saw it on the website, I was like, oh my God, I need to have this in my collection. I don't have anything like this. This is the type of short that looks like a skirt type of look. And shorts like this are so flattering and so easy to wear. I mean, I could wear these type of shorts micro, like really short, and still not cross over into the hooker territory. So I'm good with that. They're just beautiful and they work seamlessly into any wardrobe because you can wear anything with these type of shorts. They look great. So, I mean, you know, let's see how they look. I'm excited about this one. I'm more excited about this one because taking it out of the bag and I'm feeling the material super aggressive. And when I am buying from brands that are affordable, let's be honest, the materials are not the best, right? So when I see something that's aggressive and raw like this, for me, that's already telling me this shit is gonna last me forever. It's going to be worth my money. 
This is like a jean material. This also came in the denim, but I opted for the white. What makes this a little bit more special is the fact that it has these ruffles around the sleeves and it's giving me Isabel Moran type of vibes. I was like, bitch, if I could get Isabel Moran on this body, even though it's like an imitation, I don't really care. I'm gonna go for it. It looks great, it looks promising. Let's try it on. I'm gonna try it on with the shorts and see if it's a whole vibe and everything. I hope it fits well, oh my God, pray for me. Let's see how it looks. love the shirt a little bit more than everything else to be honest with you so i might end up keeping it i don't know guys next is a dress i don't know what the fuck happened when i ordered this dress i think i was drunk i would never buy a dress like this i do not know what happened i'm assuming it's it was one of those ordeals where it looks completely different online than when you receive it because for the life of me i don't understand what the hell happened but but for all the negativity i'm a very open person in general so i love the color i love the fact that it's one of those trapeze type of dresses which are ultra forgiving and so effortless for the summer i'm seeing the super voluminous sleeve with the super voluminous bottom and it's giving me anxiety let's try it on and see what happens oh my god i feel like this is the haul from hell I'm not gonna lie, when I first saw this dress, I was literally laughing maybe for like 10 minutes straight. This dress just gives me clown vibes. This dress is not for me. But am I gonna keep this? Oh my, oh my god, oh my god. This is the piece de resistance. This is the highly anticipated dress, the one that I was looking forward to the most. Just look at the material. I can't open the shit here because it's a super long dress and so you're not even gonna see it, so what's the point? But don't worry, I'm gonna try it on. It's beautiful. I mean, I'm looking at it right here. It's beautiful. It's like a pale pink silky number. It looks stunning. I saw this on the website and I had to calm down. Well, I was calm because I didn't have matcha that day, but it's like one of those beautiful, elegant, sexy, beautiful, I just said beautiful, striking type of dresses. This is the dress that I'm looking forward to wearing. After all my scary tests are done, colonoscopy, my endoscopy, I'm so nervous. This is what I'm looking forward to. Putting on this dress and going out with my husband, I don't really care where. This is going to be what I'm looking forward to. You better not do me wrong. I'm gonna try you on, I'm super excited. Ah! Oh my God, I'm excited. Let's fucking try it on. Shut the fuck up, Daisy. it is so beautiful and elegant it makes me feel some type of way but uh, i don't like it i don't like the fit of it it just looks all kinds of wrong i don't even think it's about a sizing because the size on this one fits me perfect it's just at the seam it's not made well like this why is this here this line here when the belt is up here see how this lands here? it's just poorly made that's what it is i mean it sucks because the dress is just so stunning and I wanted to try something different and have this to look forward to. 